What is up guys? Welcome back to our vlog channel. Hello, I am out of focus. Hi, I'm back. So it is a beautiful winter day here at the beginning of November. Currently the, what is it Dan? The 8th? Today. And so we had our huge snowfall yesterday, which you would have seen in our last vlog and honestly thought it was gonna melt, but it has not. There is snow all over the ground still. I will show you guys in a second. It's also like four degrees below zero today. Yeah, it's cold today. And we're supposed to get snow this weekend and next week. So it's just gonna keep going with the snow, which is honestly fine because it gets my mind so excited for Christmas. I just hope it doesn't, ha like a few years ago, what happened was it snowed in November. And then it melted and got really warm in December and we almost had a green Christmas. And I just don't like that because living in Canada, you get the luxury of having a beautiful, sparkling, white Christmas. And to not have that, you're kind of like, what the heck? So I'm hoping that um, if it does melt, that it comes back for Christmas or that it just lasts until Christmas. What I don't like is the snow lasting until April. That pisses me off because it is way too long. I'm so over the snow by then. It's usually why I end up traveling because I'm just like, I freaking hate this, but I'm gonna be having a baby. So I cannot be traveling, especially in like March and April. So that's gonna be a time where I'm just gonna be bundled up inside watching Netflix. That's my life, waiting for the baby to come, which is fine. I'm gonna show you guys in right now. It's actually kind of sunny today, which is weird. It's like a sunny, freezing cold day. So here you go. This is the outside. So over here it's kind of melted, but like there's still snow everywhere, all over the trees, on the table. Yeah, there's just a lot of snow. Update on Boo Bear. He's feeling so much better today and he's so handsome. He's still sneezing a little, but it's way better than it was. So it's slowly going away. He still has his appetite. He has his energy levels up. He went for a walk today. Oh. <laughs> Thank you for the kisses. You're so cute. You guys, I wish you could pet him. He is so soft. He barely sheds, especially for a golden. I feel I felt like I always imagined owning a golden retriever, having fur everywhere, just because my friends, that's what happens. Oh, oh, okay. Thank you, Mr. Sneezy Boy. Ew. Okay, that's gross, guys. Sorry, he's got legit boogers. I'll just film his paw. <laughs> But I think because of his diet, he doesn't shed. He's also so soft and he doesn't stink. Excuse me, you're clinging. You're clinging. Is it because you know the camera's on you? So you want to be very handsome for all the viewers? All of your fans. You're getting ready for all of your fans. Are we gonna do a meetup with Boo Bear? That would be so cute if we just had a Boo meetup. You guys can hang out with us and like pet Boo. What? Oh, oh. Oh, okay. Oh, he's stretching. <laughs> okay, sneeze in my crotch. That's fine. <laughs> he's literally attached to me. It's so cute. It's because you know I'm pregnant, don't you? Okay, this is a lot of boo content. You're so handsome. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Oh, now you're looking for Papa, aren't you? I'm so weird with dogs. So today we're actually running an errand. We're going to the bank and then we're actually gonna go to the mall because I wanna check out some maternity clothes at H&M. I don't know if they sell them in the store, but I figured there would be maternity clothes in the mall somewhere. I don't know my sizes of things. I'm not like full, full pregnant yet. So I, I, I'm at that awkward stage where like, my clothes aren't fitting me, but like maternity clothes might be too big. So I don't know. I just need to like go and explore and see things in person before I start ordering things online and getting all wrong sizes. Look, the Christmas tree's up, you guys. Feels a little early for that. <laughs> no, that makes me happy. I saw someone share something on Facebook. It was like a picture with writing. And it said, the reason it snows early in November is because of those people that decorate for Christmas too early. You know who you are, stop it. Me. <laughs> I would, but Dad wants to save it till Vlogmas. Well, because it makes it fun for Vlogmas. I know, but I want to decorate now because I'm we too excited. Can, we can decorate now and then take it down, dude. <laughs> okay, guys, so H&M didn't have anything in the store, but it's cute because we saw some like really nice baby clothes that got us excited. We're not buying anything yet just because I feel like we're going to get a lot as gifts. Yes. Um, but we did. We got some records. Two records. And I got a game. Yeah. And that's all we did, so now we're heading home. Guys, the clouds are so crazy right now. Big snowstorm clouds. Is it snow or rain? Because it's like sunny over here. You know what, it looks like you can actually see snow coming down. 
bizarre. You see? I don't know if you can see it on camera, but there's like scratches almost. Yeah, kind of. So we got the Fleetwood Mac Rumors vinyl. Um, vinyl. Vinyl. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you guys aren't gonna get it. Alex used to say vinyl. No, I said it one time. <laughs> Anyways, it was funny because this was in the used section, so it's like kind of beat up and stuff But they said the actual like disc itself isn't too bad. So they sold it for like 12 bucks I kind of like when the, uh, I kind of like when the packaging is a little banged up. Yeah, I like it too The only thing scrap. is it's it's annoying when the disc is like um, I think one of the ones we got at uh, Melrose Trading Post in LA I, I think it's the Elton John one. Yeah, it's it skips, it skips. Which is typical when you're buying a, a like a free like a flea market. Yeah, it's like three bucks. But like this one was twelve dollars, and it's pretty good, con pretty good condition, which is fine. I didn't mind spending more. And then this one Dan got for ten bucks, I think. Yeah, it was ten bucks, and it has a mint sticker on it. Which nice. Is pretty cool. I only know this one song, so I'll learn the other ones. But I like the one song, so it's pretty cool. And the one song is called Spanish Train. <laughs> and then Dan got this which is Death Stranding, which is a new video game. Is that the guy from uh, Walking Dead? It, it is, it's Norman Reedus. Okay, that's pretty cool that he's in a video game. Mads Mikkelsen is in it too. So I'm gonna watch Dan play. I don't play PS4 because I don't know how to use the controller. <laughs> I wasn't allowed video games growing up, so I'm really bad at anything other than Nintendo 64, which I used at my cousin's house. Yeah, anything more than two analog sticks, you have a bit of an issue, which not really that true though, because you played Mario. You played Mario Odyssey. Yeah, but it follows you. Does it? Yeah, it does. It's you can have, no, you can, I mean, maybe you can set it up to be, but. And because my, my parents, I don't know if it was my parents, I just know my, my mom didn't want them in the house, or maybe it was my dad, I honestly don't know. I just knew, I just know that my 13th birthday, I got a Game Boy Color, and it was like the best present I ever received as a kid. I played that every single day in the car on the way to swim team practice at Donkey Kong Country, and that was the only game I owned, and I loved it. And then I played Sega and Nintendo 64 at my cousin Rick's house in his basement. Played a bunch of those games, but I never had like Xbox or PlayStation or anything like that growing up. We never even got the Wii. So when I started dating Dan, okay. Obviously, he's huge into video games, but I just didn't know how to use the controller. I would get frustrated, so I just gave up <laughs> by like watching him play. Hey guys, so today is Saturday, and normally we'll do the podcast on Sundays, but my family's coming over to spend the day uh, today, this afternoon, and for dinner. So we, I texted my brother, being like, "Do you want to just do the podcast on Saturday before everyone else gets here? That way, it saves him having to come again on Sunday. He can just stay at home and relax all day." So that's what we're doing. So we're just getting set up to do the podcast this morning. We have everything out and ready to go. Just waiting for Tim to get here. Alex has got her nice, relaxing pregnancy chair, and uh, we'll. We'll be good to go. Me and Boo this morning went for a nice long run and I'm very proud because it's negative six degrees Celsius this morning and he did such an amazing job. Yes, you did. You did an amazing, amazing job, Boo. I was very proud of you. But I think he's very pooped from his long run this morning. Oh, look who it is, Boo Bear. You're very happy, huh? Oh, yes. <laughs> Tim gives the best scratches, huh? Tim gives the best butt scratches. <laughs> As we get that on camera. <laughs> right, boo boo? Oh, right. bless you. Right, boo boo? Okay. Okay, boo. That's enough. <laughs> Shh. Oh, you're too hyper. Shh. Good boy. Good dog. Good boy. Get a little too excited because Tim's here. After the two minute introduction, then we'll start. <laughs> Okay guys, so it is currently snowing outside a lot. And my sister is coming over. We're gonna take some winter photos. I have two outfits that I want to take pictures in. And I have this hat on that I wore in Banff last year. It's from Free People, it's so soft. This is from Victoria's Secret Pink that I got last year and just wearing leggings, some thick socks. I'm gonna put on some winter boots. Dan right now is in the process of getting some snacks, cookies, chips, and things ready for his family that's coming over. Also kind of doing like a pseudo lunch snack. 
and Tim's just chilling. <laughs> hey, <laughs> we finished recording the podcast. And yeah, Kyla and I had plans to take pictures today and then we were actually gonna do a leaf raking day, but because it snowed, we canceled that. But Dan's family's still gonna come over and hang out. And Tim actually told us the same thing that a lot of you guys said by keeping the leaves on top of the grass and then in the springtime, like kind of mowing them into mulch is actually better for the environment. So I think we're just gonna do that because honestly it's like, there's no point in picking up all the leaves right now. There's so much snow outside. All right, guys, it's now another day, or I should say evening. It's another day, but it's not quite the day. It's almost the evening. Well, it's only four o'clock, but it, it's so dark that it feels so late. It feels later than four o'clock, but it's four o'clock. We're about to head out to go to Alex's parents' house for Sunday dinner, and I'm excited because they told us what they're making this morning, and actually, you know what? We're gonna make a little surprise for when you guys get there, but what they said they're making is gonna be really, really good, so we're excited. Oh. Look at this spread, guys. What are you guys making? Breaded chicken. Breaded chicken. Mama, Mama's breaded with uh, breaded breadcrumbs and some with cornflakes. Cornflake crumbs. Oh, it's actually cornflake well, crumbs. Well, no, it's it's regular breadcrumbs, but we're running out, so. So you're gonna, gonna do use. you're gonna like supplement. Yeah. And, and then you're doing cauliflower, potatoes, potatoes, and cauliflower soup. Cauliflower oh my soup. god. It's gonna be good. We also gonna have a salad. And we also have a cake. And, and we have a cake. Oh my god! Look at all this. Baked, Look at this. This one. Oh, Opera beautiful. Cake. Whoa. Oops, and apple pie. Oh, oh, apple crisp, even better. And bread. Oh, you guys are kind of matching. Chips <laughs> are. <laughs> <laughs> So food is ready, cauliflower soup, got some bread, potatoes, chicken, I'll grab a spoon. So there's basically, just kind of focus, there's basically carrots, cauliflower, a bunch of other things, it's just like really freaking good. <laughs> Kyla's so excited. Spoon? No, Mama's sitting there. Mama's sitting there? Okay. So the oh, soup so is no somebody soup. else's. Yeah. So put the We're soup. missing two spoons still. Oh, I'll get it. Oh, oh, I think that, that, does that have? Floor. That's not? Oh, that's for Lola. Yeah, Lola. That's, that's for Lola. Yeah. Hey guys, so it's another day and we are in a super different location, but Alex's grandmother, Mama, who you guys have seen many times in the vlogs, is letting us use her car because especially with the baby coming, it's smart to have two cars in case of any kind of emergency. But we got here today to pick it up and it doesn't start. So <laughs> I have it hooked up right now with the jumper cables. It really wants to start. It really, really does. I've tried a few times, but I'm gonna let it charge. So I just have it hooked up from our battery. The cables are on the other side of the car to this one. I, every time I try, it like almost wants to start, but I'm gonna let the battery get a bit more juice so it'll hopefully kickstart the engine. But fingers crossed. Well, that looks really weird on camera. <laughs> fingers crossed it's gonna work. No double cancels. No, I always double cross. Oh, okay. Extra luck. Okay, so Dan's gonna try and start it. We also are trying to do this quick because there's supposed to be a huge snowstorm today. Yeah. 25 centimeters they're calling for. So as you can see here, I'm not gonna touch it, but there's like a little wheel there that tries to... It's the belt from the engine. Yeah, it tries to spin when he starts the car and it just won't do it. See, it's like kind of spinning. Oh. Hey guys, so it turns out we couldn't start the car unfortunately, so Dan's gonna go back with my uncle another day and see if they can deflood the engine. Um, I the battery's know, fine. I, I don't know if that's the problem. Well, he, Roger put a brand new battery in, so yeah, it's I, definitely not the battery. Maybe I just had to let it charge a little bit longer without doing anything. But well, that's what you guys are gonna Normally gonna that do. doesn't, you don't have to do it that much, so. But while he was working on that, and I went, I went and got my passport photos taken, which are so bad. I'm not even gonna show you guys because it's like, I, it looks like a mugshot. It looks like I'm gonna go to jail. Not cute, which sucks because my old one was so nice. Like I loved it so much. I was shocked at how nice it was. But it was also one of those things that if I'd show up at the airport with no makeup on, <laughs> they'd like look at me and be like, "Is this you?" Anyways, now I'll probably look more like my passport pictures even though I am wearing makeup. I still look like not very good. All right guys, so we are expecting 
It used to be 10 centimeters tonight, but it's supposed to be even more than that. You can see it's just starting to snow. So we'll keep an eye out for this all night and we'll, uh, we'll keep you guys tuned in to see how much snow we end up getting by tomorrow morning. Okay, so it's not the best lighting because it's the little like porch light, but you can see we're getting some snow. So it's gonna keep going all night. We're gonna see how much we get in the morning. All right guys, I'm taking Boo out to go to the bathroom and you can see there's already quite a bit of snow. And it's only about 9.30 or 10 o'clock at night. So it's only gonna get worse throughout the night. We'll see how much there's gonna be in the morning. It's gonna be pretty cool to see how much we finally get. But we'll see you guys tomorrow morning with the final update. Okay, Boo, it's the morning. Let's see the damage. <gasps> oh, that's a lot of snow, Boo. Oh my goodness. Holy crap. That's a lot of snow and it's still snowing. Boo Bear, it's snowing. There's so much. There's so much snow. Okay, come, let's go make a pee pee. Come on. Come on. <laughs> oh my goodness. Boo Bear. Boo Bear. The snow bunny. Come on. Come on! Oh, he's getting the leaves out. <laughs> Go on, make a pee pee. Oh, he just sits. Are you digging? Digging boy? You love the snow? <laughs> he's so happy. All right, guys, that's the end of this vlog. It is still snowing. But if you want to see the final tally on how much snow we've gotten, you're going to have to tune into the next vlog, which is going to be out in a few days. So thank you so much for watching this one, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!